Hello everyone, welcome back. For today's lesson, we are going to study the difference between adjective and adverb. What can you remember about the difference between adjective and adverb? Adjective is used to modify nouns or pronouns, while an adverb is used to modify verbs, adjectives, or other adverbs. Adjective and adverb are modifiers. They give precision to words they modify. They describe, identify, or provide information about other words. As I've already said, adjectives modify nouns. Examples, I bought a new cell phone. In this sentence, the adjective is new and it modifies the noun cell phone. The adjective comes before the noun. The movie was funny. Funny is the adjective and it modifies the noun movie. Adjectives are usually placed before a noun they modify, like in the first example. But when used with linking verbs, they are placed after the verb. Adjectives also modify pronouns. Examples, you are beautiful. The adjective is beautiful and it modifies the pronoun you. He is kind and handsome. In this sentence, we have two adjectives, kind and handsome, and they both modify the pronoun he. Let's now proceed to adverbs. Adverbs modify verbs. Examples. He entered the room quietly. The adverb is quietly and it modifies the verb entered. John thinks seriously. Seriously is the adverb and it modifies the verb thinks. How did he enter the room? Quietly. How does John think? Seriously. Quietly and seriously are examples of adverbs of manner, and they tell us how the action are performed. Adverbs modify adjectives. Examples. Jodis is exceptionally beautiful. The adverb is exceptionally, and it modifies the adjective beautiful. The adverb exceptionally tells us how beautiful Jodis is. You are too young to get married. The adverb to modifies the adjective young. Adverbs modify other adverbs. Look at these examples. He works fast. Fast is the adverb and it modifies the verb works. You arrived early. Early is the adverb and it modifies the verb arrived. In this sentences, adverbs modify verbs. Take note that fast and early can be adjective or adverb, but in this sentences, they are used as adverbs because they modify verbs. Now, let's take a look at these examples. He works very fast. In this sentence, we have two adverbs. The first adverb, very, modifies the second adverb, fast. You arrived so early. The adverb, so, modifies another adverb, early. The first adverb tells us the intensity of another adverb. Adjective or adverb. It was a hard exam. The word hard is used as an adjective because it modifies the noun exam. She works hard. In this sentence, the word hard is used as an adverb because it modifies the verb works. Now, let's see another difference between adjective and adverb. Adjective answers the questions what kind, how many, and which one. Well, an adverb answers the questions how, when, where, and to what extent the action of the verb took place. Again, 
Adjectives answer the questions what kind, how many, and which one. Example, white dress. The adjective is white. Big house. The adjective is big. Adjectives give us further details about nouns. What kind of dress? White. What kind of house? Big. Other examples. Supportive parent. Creative writing. The underlined words are all adjectives. Adjectives answer the question, how many? It can be specific, for example, three pens, ten books or general such as some students, several proposals. These adjectives are called quantitative adjectives. Adjectives answer the question, which one? Examples, this bag, that store, which bag, this bag, which store, that store. Other examples, these words, those girls, this, that, these, and those are called demonstrative adjectives. They specifically describe which noun they refer to. Let's now proceed to adverbs. Adverbs answer the questions how, when, where, and to what extent the action of the verb took place. Examples. She speaks slowly. He talks convincingly. The adverbs are slowly and convincingly, and they are examples of adverbs of manner. They tell us how actions are performed. Adverbs answer the question when. Examples. I saw Heidi yesterday. Ellie studies every day. Yesterday and every day are examples of adverbs of time. They tell us when an action happened. Adverbs answer the question where. For example, I put the book there. There is the adverb. Another example, I'm going home. The adverb is home. Home is a noun, but it functions as an adverb because home in this sentence means direction. There and home are examples of adverbs of place. They tell us where actions are performed. Adverbs answer the question to what extent. Examples. He runs very fast. The coffee was extremely hot. Very and extremely are examples of adverbs of degree. They tell us the degree or the extent of an action, an adjective, or another adverb. Let's review. What do adjectives and adverbs modify? Adjectives are used to modify nouns or pronouns, while adverbs are used to modify verbs, adjectives, or other adverbs. What questions do adjectives and adverbs answer? Adjectives answer the questions what kind, how many, and which one, while adverbs answer the questions how, when, where, and to what extent the action of the verb took place. This is the end of this lesson. I hope you understand the difference between adjectives and adverbs now. Thank you for listening.